Hi, Jason Ott with CE Pro, and I'm excited to be talking about audio today with Brian Azano, Vice President of Manufacturing at Stealth Acoustics. Brian, thanks for joining me today. Hey, Jason. Thanks for having me. All right, let's uh, jump right into it. How can integrators build outdoor theaters for their clients simply? Well, one of the simplest approaches we've found is to be able to easily purchase a pre-assembled product and fit it into the landscaping. And that's pretty much exactly what we try to offer with the patio theater product. So uh, the patio theater, you know, is a large scale outdoor turnkey entertainment system uh, that's really ready to go right upon delivery. So we've basically taken the guesswork out of, uh, out of, for, away from the integrator from having to source things like lifts and control systems uh, and then combining that with any sort of large format outdoor viewable screen. And we've ta basically taken all those technologies and put them into one package that can easily be deployed and commissioned. Uh, fantastic. Yeah, the, the Stealth Patio Theater. Let's talk a little bit more about the, the TV technology um, engaged there. Why are you seeing more integrators moving towards flat panel uh, LEDs versus a uh, projection in outdoor environments? Well, as many integrators can probably attest to, uh, you know, the, the segment of projection when used outdoors has a lot of limitations and challenges. Uh, at the very um, most basic level, we have a fundamental challenge of, of competing with daylight. Uh, so daylight viewability on projection systems is really not the route you want to go. And when you start to combine in other uh, issues that creep into an outdoor installation, such as environmental protection, uh, screen windage problems with screens, uh, you know, LED is really what's shaping up to be the future of outdoor and even to some extent some in indoor uh, viewing solutions. What are some of the benefits integrators will encounter using LED in an outdoor environment? So, uh, you know, the, the market is definitely starting to look towards LED and how LED got its origins. Uh, to be able to take some of that technology and put it into the residential space. Uh, and, it, you know, it comes with some tremendous benefits over, say, projection or even uh, flat panel weatherized TVs. Uh, some of those benefits are extremely uh, high, bright daylight viewability. So just like the billboards that you see in Times Square or on the Strip in Las Vegas, LED was designed initially to be able to be ultra bright and to be able to see, be seen from long distances in broad daylight. So the same principles hold true with uh, when you, we move this segment into the residential living space. Uh, we want to be able to use LED so that we can watch that football game on a Sunday afternoon uh, with, with no fears of being able to uh, or no, no, no problems having a washed out screen. We also have extreme durability with LED and the long lifespan. Because this technology is pulled from the signage industry, we're looking at 100,000 hour plus lifespans on these TVs. And also a, a, a very, very good amount of serviceability. What are some of the challenges that integrators might face in terms of creating good quality audio in an outdoor theater environment? That's a really good question, Jason. And you know, we've got uh, we've got two types of outdoor systems often in these types of living spaces. We've got um, an architectural or landscape type system where we're really trying to fill. Uh, the, the entire space of the yard or the pool area with, with space filling sound. Uh, or we've got a theater type arrangement where we, we want very uh, directional sound, at least from the front sound stage. So I think the challenge for integrators is finding solutions that can um, present the best of both worlds, so to speak, so that a client can truly have a mixed use space, a space where they might be entertaining, where they want a distributed audio type arrangement, and then alternate, alternately, they may want to switch to a more of a surround sound type uh, experience when they want to maybe watch a movie or watch that football game on a Sunday afternoon. So now we're moving into the outdoor season uh, and a lot of integrators are going to see their outdoor business start to pick up now in the spring. Where should they go if they want to find out more information about the Stealth Patio Theater and your other products? They should definitely take a look at our website. Uh, it's stealthacoustics.com. There you can find all the details on uh, all the different LED TV options for, for outdoor use, as well as more information on our IP68 rated outdoor loudspeakers as well.